All right, guys, I gotta get my camera set up here. Anyway, I'm just going to do a quick Casper because I didn't do the bottles earlier. And I think you do want to separate it. I think you do want to um, – yeah, the problem is if you come out and you've already got the bottles there, it's just going to go that direction. So this is just completely – and I just remember they're just sort of incidental. I'm not – I'm not trying to throw them. So we got to be careful, Mahesh, that we don't have the kids throwing stuff for now. Because I'm not really throwing anything. He's just bringing me things. And there is a difference. There is a difference. Right? He's, and so he defaults to the down. And if you said, how long did it take you to t I think they learn it the first day. That's why I think people have problems with them jumping up and stuff. They learn that the first day, too. All right, so I can just do a suggestion if I wanted to lay down. My hand kind of drops. You know, and if you said, well, that doesn't seem like a signal for down. Well, it does to him. It's whatever you make it. All right, so if the bottle goes flying, then he's going to. I've got to tell you, he's pretty amazing. Now he lays back down. So basically, he'll get your slippers and then lay back down. And you know, and I do think the bottles are a good one because they are very lightweight. Every dog already likes bottles, and they do make a noise. You do want a noise, I think. And we got to teach the kids how to do the yay. Oh, kids love the yay. Anyway, so the bottles are just going to kind of fall. I did kind of fling him, but he didn't see me. So I'm not trying to tell him to bring it or anything. I'm just, I'm just completely enamored of what I see. And Mike, you want, might want to leave now. Traffic's probably bad on the bridge around rush hour, so you may want to just leave now. And he defaults back to the down. And if you said, all right, now watch. He's going to default back to the down. And honestly, I, I'm not sure how that came to be, but it's basically just. Yay! 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 Yeah, you might want to head out, Mike. The traffic's probably going to get bad there to, during rush hour. <laughs> And I've got my pager. I am going to start using the pager on it. I got them on the charger. I hadn't used those in forever. And uh, I got to get Jackie to help me because um, somehow the Martin got off of Vibrate. So I got to get that fixed. I can just put the Martin on him as soon as I get that fixed. Oh, he's a little bubble butt. This one. He is a little bubble butt. Even that close to him, though, I'm letting him know I don't touch you. I don't touch you. You don't want that to be a component of the training. It's just not going to work. It's just not going to work. Alright, the bottle's going to go flying. So, we need to be careful with this, though, because we don't want the kids just throwing stuff all the time. But we do want to be ready if he brings things. And I do like him to start getting these he saw me touching it. You know, I could maybe make it go flying. If you said, what's the difference? You know, I don't know that he doesn't know it doesn't just launch out. I don't want to have, at this point, I don't want to seem like I'm throwing things. Let's just put it that way. And if you said, why? Well, I'm not sure. I have to say, I'm not sure. There's probably somebody that knows the answer. But there's more... You know, later, it, you are going to be implying when you throw something that you want it returned. At this point, I'm really not, you know. And then he drinks the water. I think you should always, like, have the water right there when you're training puppies. You 
know, and if you said, well, you know, how long do you train them? I'm just doing little short bursts, and then we're just back to, yay. Honestly, going on your Facebook, going on your phone or whatever, that's kind of the lifestyle we have to teach these dogs to. Oh, yay, 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 yay. And I'm going to tell you, I looked just in time to see that. If you said, why did you see it? I saw it because it this thing was orange. I saw it out of the corner of my eye. You know, I really do think those glasses would be a good thing. Uh, glasses that had like a surround camera. Honestly, that had a computer program that told you when the dog was doing things, people who can't see it themselves. Dog is backing away. Back off, back off. Anyway, that's where we're at, Mahesh. I am I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm beyond thrilled with the way this puppy's doing. You know, and it's not, I'm not setting out in any way to say, well, I'm gonna wait till he bites me and correct him, only because I understand biting is a behavior that, that we sort of inadvertently initiate. So if we're initiating it and then initiating an attack afterwards, <laughs> You know, they're just gonna they're just gonna fight off the attack. There's my suggestion. You're always watching. If you've got a suggestion, you're always looking at their head. I put that bulldog out in the kennel today. If you wonder what that barking is, I couldn't take it. I couldn't take it. I put him out in the kennel. So the other hand comes in with the treat. This hand didn't have any reaction. You know, that's what you've got to practice. If he wants to bite at my hand, it doesn't move at all. You know, and I think where a lot of people are wrong is, I think where, you know, one thing that I do do with puppies is I do always have their crate elevated. So it's your... You've got to handle them. Because I always say don't touch them. But I don't mean don't handle them. I mean you should totally be able to handle them. Um, and that helps because it's... There's no other way to get out of there. There's no other way to get out of there. My precious angel. Yeah, Donna, I've got to tell you, I don't know if any of these are going for service dogs or whatever, but oh, I can tell you. Oh, they would be the best ones ever. Oh, he already does everything. He already does it all. You know, but I'm not, and, and that's what we've got to try to remember, Mahesh, and this is where kids go wrong. They really don't want their head touched any more than if you brought the kids here and I just kept trying to touch their heads. They're not going to want that, and they're eventually going to put their hands up. You know, that's what I always say to people, you know, because if they think that the puppy's aggressive and it's really them doing it, I set up a scenario where it was me doing that to their kids. Then I'm telling them, listen, lady, you got some aggressive kids here. You know, but that's... If you said what would be the best behavior to install as a default when you're sitting down, a down, you really wouldn't even want it to be a sit because they can't really, I mean, they're going to just sit there so long before they're going to lay down. It's better just to go straight to the down. Anyway, Mahesh, she's doing absolutely perfect, and I will be live again with him in the morning. And then I will see you guys Saturday. But I think you can see where this is going to work out. You know, if you're working at home or if you're on the computer or whatever, if, you know, we maybe need to have some little beds throughout the house, you know, that he could just start defaulting to laying on. You know, you'll thank me later. You know, and I really, if you said, well, what commands does he know? Everything he knows really so far is just a default behavior. You know, so that's... It's, uh, trust me, it comes in way more handy than having to give a bunch of commands that they don't want to do. He thinks that he wants to do these things. Hi, Lanny. I hope you liked that. I hope you've been getting some tips. I hope you've been practicing the, uh, uh, some of the stuff at your house. So, 
Anyway, guys, that was just my little late afternoon session with him. But I think you could see, you know, I've not corrected this dog. I've not, you know, put a leash on it, pulled it, anything like that. They're not ready for that. They're not ready for that. You know, if you said, well, how would you do it? All I've got to do is get him following me. All I have to do is get him following me first, you know. And then I can put a leash on him. Everything I do, everything I do, you know, if you ask that puppy, has, does this, has this thing ever come at you? Never, never. It runs away. I chase it everywhere. All right, you guys, I gotta go charge this phone. How cute is he, though? Oh, he's worried about that. Oh, Mike, you didn't, uh, you, oh, you're gonna have to go back and watch the video, because I said you may want to uh, leave now, because... I'm assuming the traffic, uh, I'm assuming the traffic gets bad, you know, on the bridge at rush hour, so you may want to leave now. <laughs> anyway, he's doing unbelievable, so.